All right, so now that now that we know where we are again, uh, we need to pick a spot. I'm trying to remember where we gotta go. Let's see. Let me just do the Scalding Glade. That's the farthest zone we have. So now we kind of went off on a tangent to find the dungeon with the bells. Sounds like your character needs some cardio, dude. I just, the problem, so part of the problem is I have 10 points of warrior, but melee is just, it's just not worth using, sadly. Uh, I'd much rather have that in endurance or over in, um, you know, world walker or uh, recovery. I mean, executioner, I want, I want 20% chance to crit. That is, that is good. Okay, this is, this is correct. Big old crits. Yeah, I know I do get a respect thing, but I still got to get that far. I think stamina regenerate would be my next big investment. Yeah. I think going, well, no, let me try and go up first. Let me try going up first and see what is that way. I feel like I'm getting XP a lot faster playing solo. I wonder if it's because all the enemies are scaled to my level. What the hell? Attack it, man. What's the problem with melee? I think it's worth getting, especially if you got friends that have it. I mean, the reload's ass, but I kind of want to go back to my five shot crossbow. I th think. I think this was the, the bell dungeon. I'll know in a second, though, so. I want to say we took a path going north. No, we have definitely been here. Okay. Have been here, haven't been to the other area. Would it be possible to use your Discord? I mean, we we have a LFG channel that's designed just for that. Just go in the channel and be like, hey, anybody uh, want to play Remnant? <clears throat> you might get somebody. I mean, it's not it's not like my channel is designed just for this one game, but I do have a channel for uh, people that are trying to find friends to play with. Uh. 
Yeah, I don't know. What do you guys think about this? Because th this thing seems kind of cool, but it also seems fairly like a niche. Like, it doesn't seem that good, you know? Like, it's not like I'm killing stuff that fast with it. I think I go back. I think I go to my Devastator. Because the Devastator was like the great clapper of cheeks. That's what I meant. I don't have friends. That is probably the most depressing statement I have read all week. make friends yeah the critic that's that's kind of what I'm thinking so we haven't been here before this is definitely new Does this game have any co-op uh supposedly it's three players but we have heard it I don't, I don't know. We tried to get a fourth in the other day, and it was not working, so. Oh, we have a thing for that. Yeah, uh, this thing. This feels like a main path and not a Anybody else getting some serious Indiana Jones vibes with that book? Hey, there's the that's the helmet for the uh the set. The the yeah. Good chance set. Damn, that thing is really heavy. It's heavier than Void Skull. Yeah. No, no, it's lighter than Void Skull. 2.5 crit chance stacking up to 10 times. Stop. Ow, ow, stop. Ow, I'm too slow to run from these guys. Leave me alone. Oh my god, another one, dude. Heavy armor is not meant for solo play. It's like, it's literally like on my ass. Get off of me. Get off of me. That was rough. Take this. Do I have anything that gets rid of infection? Yeah. Did it die? I don't think it died. Where did it go? I was so busy trying to stay alive, did it just despawn? It escaped and goes and kills all the NPCs. <laughs> I don't think that's what happens. Let me try uh, leaving and coming back in and seeing what happens. 
I mean, the bugs might have killed it. Because those bugs are strong. But I don't think so, man. The part of the problem, my build is designed to be like a frontline support, not a solo. Leave the area, it'll respawn for you to attempt at fighting again. I figured that would have reset it, but I'll, I'll try and leave and come back in, see what happens. I might need to change my build up a little bit to fight this thing. Go to like the thorn, because it would. Part of the problem is this armor is so slow, I just can't get away from it. So I might need to go back to my thorns, and um, thorns, and then just melee swing it down. <sighs> I'm drinking the yellow game fuel. Maybe did did my bugs kill it? I mean, cause I to be honest, I wasn't even paying attention to its health bar. I was I was so busy running for my life that I was just like ah. So did did swarm kill it off? Maybe. Did I get an item. Um, let's see. No. Got a trait. Point. Hmm. I don't know. I mean, it doesn't make sense that... Let me try... Let me try this. Mixelpix did this. It got away and went and killed some NPC. He did kill it there, though. You're telling me this thing legit escapes and kills NPCs? I mean, the only NPC I can think of it would try and kill is the, the crit one. So, let's go check, because that person sells armor. Oh my god, you know what? That would make sense. Because I didn't buy the armor because I was waiting to find the helmet and I found the helmet. Maybe this thing goes after the person that was selling the armor. That would be an oof. Yeah. No, they're safe. Oh no, they're not. It did kill her. You dickhead! I needed that armor! from you Fuck. well to be fair that that is probably worth it because I got that ring that cost a hundred thousand money the hundred thousand dollar ring is probably worth more than the armor set. I can always buy the armor set on like Bobby's playthrough. But still, that's some bullshit. Poor merchant lady. 
then I got traits. Scrap boost. Ooh, so just money boost and then melee damage reduction. Yeah, it kind of... Well, if I had bought the things, I wouldn't have cared, but... I agree. Very, very frustrating. <laughs> I'm like, what the shit? Because that armor is pretty crazy. If you think about it, if you have all three pieces... Um, critical hits, increase critical hit chance, and damage. Stacking up to ten times. So... At full set bonus... I have an extra 25% crit and 25% critical hit damage. And right now, my critical hit chance is already at 18. That's going to get higher from the trait. So that'll go up to, to 20. So, like, fully loaded out, it would be, like, you know, 20%, 25, and then having that armor set would put me up to 50. So I'd have a 50% chance to crit. Just constant, just bah, 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 bah. that's a big ass damage boost. That's like a demon hunter Diablo kind of thing. Um, so where did I come from? Somewhere in the Scalding Glade. That's all I know. If it had gotten away again, would it have killed again? I don't know. It's dead now. It's dead now. And I got that ring that reduces... Is it reduce melee damage received? Reduce incoming melee damage. Well, that does sound like it would be nice for a melee build. But... Oh, I want to go... I wish you had more ring slots. Like, I always feel so limited by just having two ring slots. Like you have ten fingers or anything. I know, right? Damn my character and his two singular fingers. So we went... Oh. I was looking at the map. Get off of me. want some boom. It is $40. That's correct. So that's where we... I'm trying to remember. This Is, is this where we came from? This is where we fought the thing? Oh, I know we came up here. That's all I remember. I think that was the thing. Whoa. That Whoa. was where the thing escaped from.
So we're gonna keep going down. Where's Bob and Tox? I don't know. Uh, it's Sunday. Maybe they're sleeping. Maybe they're enjoying their weekend, relaxing. This looks like a house. Houses have loot for me. Now we're kind of a bad guy just showing up here and like, I'm gonna break into your house, I'm gonna break all your pots, I'm gonna take everything of value, and I'm gonna kill some people. Dude's got a big head. He took all five crossbow bolts straight to the face. Which bosses did you fight? I don't remember all their names. A bunch. That's where I gotta go. There's a checkpoint here. I want the checkpoint. Can't get the checkpoint. I probably have to fight my way past all that to get it. Whatever's over there sounds very angry. Sure sounded angry, but it looks like it's kind of a chump. Does this loop around? Yeah, we fought Groot last night. We fought uh, a dragon man thing. Looks like you're right. Melee prop weapon has to have AOE properties. They can't normally. I fought Ent last night, broke his feet, and got a hammer that does AOE impacts. What? I wanted that hammer. Damn it. Instead, we got the we got the singularity sniper rifle, which is cool, but it doesn't help me be a melee boy. Oh no, never mind. I did I did I can't get up to that bridge. What do you mean by you broke his feet? Did you just like keep hitting him? Because I want to make sure that I get this hammer on a subsequent playthrough. Because I feel, I don't know, I'm, I'm very torn about a melee build. I feel like a melee build, I feel like there's potential for melee to be crazy. I mean, you consider like the Leech Ember 
and then this achieving uh, fifteen percent after critical hit, and then you have stuff like uh, like where'd it go? This thing, two hundred percent bleeding effect. Like there's or or the other one, the uh, this guy twenty five percent increase with three enemies. Oh wait, Ent is a boss on Earth. Oh oh ooh, I never fought Ent. Melee only against butterfly ladies. Hey, man. God. This poor guy's face. I do like this crossbow SMG combo though, because like the crossbow the crossbow brings like the big like I'm gonna kill you now damage. And anything it doesn't finish off, the SMG is just like pip pippity pap. That was rough. The boss is fighting hinge on hard solo. I mean you're really not supposed to play this game first time through on hard. I get Lobos is a he's a fan of, of uh challenge runs and stuff, but I was like, the other day we had somebody that were like, Ew, why are you playing the game on normal? Like, it's it's literally, it's the exact same as, like, Anthem or Diablo. And people will be like, well, you play Diablo on Expert to start. Yeah, but you don't play it on, like, Torment 3 the first time you're going through. Difficulty has a multiplicative scaling of enemies in terms of their health and damage. The higher difficulties are quite literally, like, get geared up and then go do this. Increase ranged and melee damage by 10%. It's just a flat 10% boost. I like that. Um, I think I'm going to keep that and Helsen's Band on. Just more health and more damage. What do you want, Jackie Cat? What do you want? What you want? I don't know where the boys are. I don't know why everyone keeps asking. Like, y'all, I'm not their mothers. I don't know where they're at. I woke up, I wanted to play a game. If they were here, they would be playing. I don't know where they're at. I don't know why they're not here. I don't know if they're awake or asleep. I don't know if they're touching themselves. I do not know. I do not know. Why isn't Bobby here? I don't fucking know. Jack says, I do not know. Anyway, we got a checkpoint, so let's take a little break.